30 days with me will change your life, your relationship status, and your income. Trust me. My elbows in the front right here. Jog it over here, jog it over here. Stand up, stand up, stand up. Come on. Someone that I'm always fascinated by, one of my favorite actors, Michael B. Jordan, he had been kind of like on the skinnier side. And it seems like starting with Fantastic Four and now for Creed 2, he's just like uh, in completely insane condition. I reached out to Corey Callier, Michael B. Jordan's trainer. I'm celebrity trainer Corey Callier. About four and a half years ago, I met Michael B. Jordan. When we started off, Mike had no muscles. Throughout the years, we've trained through different movies. Coming up on Creed 2, this time I was able to take his body to a whole nother level. I'm the guy that you go to when you need to get yourself in shape really fast. By the end of this, We'll see if maybe I look like someone who could possibly be in the ring in a Creed movie. How you doing, Corey? What up, bro? Chris. Nice to meet you. Pleasure see. to meet you. Same here, bro. Same here. Same so today here. is day one of 30. All right, let me see your midsection. It's not bad. Now, what I could do with this in 30 days, I can almost guarantee you start having abs by the time we finish. Abs? You ready to get started? Very excited. Let's do it. All right, let's do it, bro. So over the next 30 days, the workout we're going to do is kind of going to match or similar to what I did on Creed. Starting off with early conditioning running, the traditional weightlifting when it comes to dumbbells, squat racks, shoulder presses, different things like that. I think your biggest challenge is going to be staying consistent. Fighting through the pain, fighting through the hurt, fighting through the I don't feel like it. You know those I don't feel like it, maybe tomorrow. Well, you only have 30 days, so you don't have tomorrow. Tell the truth, this hurts. It's supposed to. All right, so we're going to do that all over again. You ready? Right here, let's go. Come on. If you can be consistent throughout the whole process, your body will start changing. As far as Michael, this was an everyday thing for him. And you have to dedicate and discipline yourself to what you are trying to do to achieve that goal. There's no shortcuts. So we're done with day one. I didn't die yet. I don't know what happens when I go home, I might. <laughs> if I was to grade this, I would give him a C. Um, a C because he can do better. We'll go from here. You heard it. I feel like I'm just getting killed right now. This first week has been brutal. The meal prep has proven to be the most difficult uh, after the first week. And I think for a person with a nine to five who is not like an actor with a, a chef um, and you're not like being paid to dedicate your life to this, it is certainly more challenging. What people don't understand is you can be a boxer, you can be anything you want, but to give the look that you want, the real transformation comes with the diet. A lot of uh, high protein, I played with the carbohydrates depending on when he needed it and I kept the fats at a very balanced out level throughout the day. Water was very important, maybe a gallon and a half, two gallons of water a day. One thing I was not prepared for about this was just how exhausting the whole gallon of water thing is. We're just trying to create the look of a boxer. Mm -hmm. Aesthetically, where do you think we're at? I think we're at a good spot. Um, of course, we just have 30 days, so I had to get the best out of you that I can. Um, I see already changes. If you look at from the first time we interviewed, and, and right now, you can see how your arms are starting to come out, how the roundness in your shoulders come, your vascularity is coming through. As you can see now, I'm starting to see he's getting abs right now. So you see the changes coming in the muscles. So that lets you know that with me, you can change in 30 days. So for these, uh, these last two weeks, mm -hmm. uh, what are we going to change workout-wise? We're going to up the pace a little bit. We're going to add more cardiovascular stuff. We're going to add more supersets and triset training like that because we want to get the muscles going. We want to get the blood pumping. So in order to get you ripped down, I got to get you moving a little bit more faster. So the weight will come down. Story time. I had gone to a concert and, you know, I just wanted to let loose a little bit. And I had like three, I had four plus vodkas. Point being, my, my decision making became a little bit impaired, right? Concert ends, I get back, and I'm looking through the food delivery app, and what pops up? Taco Bell. Eventually, at around three, I get a notification on my phone. It's from DoorDash, and they say that the order is canceled. My initial thought, McDonald's is still open. They're 24 seven, I could just go there. But then I thought about it and I'm like, okay, maybe I should take this as a sign. Yes, I slipped up a little. It's no reason to just toss away the entire diet and throw everything off track. I'll see you, I'll see you when this is all over, Taco Bell, don't you worry. I just went for a run. It was just kind of like extra uh, cardio for the day, but I think that's a good sign because I usually have zero desire to do anything really on a Saturday night. I just feel like I'm starting to kind of get into a good groove. It's just such a limited amount of time. So when you put Corey's name on it, I just have this fear of like uh, ending it and being kind of in the same place I started. So I'm trying to make sure there's some, uh, there's some type of results here. So we're finally at our last training session. He has to make sure that we give everything today. I don't want to see him tired or hurting or something like that. 
I want to see him going all the way through it, giving everything that he can, and basically keeping up with me. Yeah, when he started off, he was a little watery, soft, 30 days later. Take a shirt off. What I put together really works. It just takes time and dedication and you to actually make it happen. Day one, workout almost died in like five minutes. Right, right, right. Didn't know if I was going to make it. How do you think uh, the day 30 performance with that fast pace, how do you think that compared? I think today uh, you was able to see him be different than you were going to see on the first day. Um, the workout was great. We did go at a very faster tempo, higher pace. I tried to make him quit. That was my goal, to always make you quit to get the best out of you. Um, as you can see, if you look at his body from the first day, his pectoral muscles, his abdominals, shoulders, upper chest, biceps, everything is starting to form. Basically what this says is that no matter who you are, movie star or not, if you take the time, consistency and discipline and do it, you can get the same type of body. I think in 30 days, we were able to do more than what I do with some actors.